says don't even disseminate these rumors it has not yet been confirmed that it's a disease that can be that can lead to lockdowns no that's not true even the sources that you are reading that you are seeing saturating those rumors that's not true the real source the real people who to, who, who gives us the guidelines and everything to follow is the World Health Organization. And the only thing we know of now, if you have one of those or more than one of those, please get tested. And when you are tested positive, don't panic. You can be treated and very soon you will recover and you will be well. Greetings everyone who follows and who subscribed here on Dr. Bob Rwanda. I'm so very much happy for everyone who has chose to be on this platform. I hope whatever you're coming here for, whatever you're seeking, the medical information, the medical knowledge, the advices from experts and everything that we're discussing here, I hope that you benefit from what you are producing, from what you are giving you. So today we are coming back in another new video. It's a video that I have chose to do it in English because of uh, many people who have requested, uh, specific, specifically those who, who follow us here at Dr. Bob Rwanda, they have requested that we do some of our videos in English because some of them they are interested but they cannot really, uh, they cannot understand or they cannot listen to King Rwanda and pick what we are saying so we have chose to use and in some of our videos to speak English so that we may even go broad we can even explain more topics as this language has a lot of verbs and vocabularies a lot of uh, words that we can use which can be easily understandable to some people especially those who understand English this does not mean that we will not be using in Rwanda anymore or we will not be shooting our videos in Rwanda, no. It's just mixing and mixing. One episode will be in English, another one will be in Rwanda. Maybe sometimes, in some few years, we'll be uploading those, those contents or those videos even in French. So I will come to you in this video. So today, what are we going to talk about? Today we are talking about Mpox as usual. So you have been hearing from different sources, you have been hearing across the social media, you have been hearing uh, across different news uh, stations, media, and, and and all those platforms. So you are hearing about Mpox, but all you are hearing, all you are listening to, is like bad news. Today I'm coming for the good news. So what can be the good news from this Mpox, this viral infection that was named Mpox, which was delivered from monkeypox you know as we said this is the disease that was uh, discovered in 1970 it was di discovered in denmark in the uh, monkeys which were taken from drc the, the democratic republic of congo which were which were taken there to be tested in the laboratory so after testing them they found that they have a virus or a, a, a potential of causing a disease and that disease was called mpox so the virus causing it is mpox virus or the monkey pox virus so all of these things that i've been discussing all the things that i've been hearing from different sources what's the good news so the good news i'm bringing today about mpox is that this mpox is preventable it is preventable it is preventable what do i mean it's your responsibility it's my responsibility to contain to stop its spread from one person to another from one nation to another so if you are hearing if you're watching this video know that this disease is preventable and the more the, the most good news or the, the the best good news is that it's curable for now it has vaccines, the vaccines has, have, have, have started, uh, they have started disseminating them and distributing them in different countries. Nigeria has got the first 10,000 doses of Mpox vaccine. So we hope anytime soon, some other countries, including ours, will be receiving those doses. So we have said that this disease is preventable, but how? So as I've seen, this disease spreads through contact, Maybe contact by greeting, by kissing, 
by touching objects or some materials which are infected. But what if you recognize that area and you take some measures? What measures? Start today. Teach yourself and practice hand washing. It's one of the best practices everyone can do and can train himself so that the chances of spreading and catching this mpox reduces. And another thing that you can do is avoiding contact with those whom you think or who have been tested positive for this mpox. So that one also can help because as we said earlier, it spreads through contacts. So you have it, I touch you, I greet you, I hug you, I kiss you, I sleep with you, all those things they expose me to this end box. So another thing that you should do, if you are found to be positive, please isolate yourself. It's better to isolate yourself in home, uh, at your home uh, in, in, and, and call. Here in Rwanda, you call 114. It's the number, uh, the Ministry of Health, where you call and they uh, can get uh, in, in contact with you and anytime they can help you. But we have uh, the community health workers, whom we call the Abajana Uzima. We have the health posts, healthcare workers. We have different people who are in, who different health care providers who are ready and are trained to help. So when you are faced with this, please isolate yourself and call or have someone call for you these people and this isolation of yourself will stop you from spreading this disease from one another from one person to another so as i conclude please if you find yourself with some of the symptoms we mentioned in the earlier videos please rush to the the facility and be tested and if you have found negative, that's good and nice. But if you have found positive, please follow all these that we are talking. So this disease is being treated and people are curing. As I've heard through the news, those uh, Guanans who were infected with this uh, virus, some, like I, 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 all of them, are already out of the hospital and they are doing well because they were tested earlier and received the proper treatment. So this is a disease which when you receive the proper treatment, you can go on with your life. You can get cured. So don't just think like uh, some people have started confusing it with the, with the COVID case which has not been confirmed if it is to be like a pandemic it will be right in that uh, big outbreak which can cause lockdowns not yet please please don't even disseminate these rumors it has not yet been confirmed that it's a disease that can be that can lead to lockdowns no that's not true even the sources that you are reading that you are seeing saturating those rumors that's not true the real source the real people who who, who gives us the guidelines and everything to follow is the world health organization and the only thing we know of now said on this is that they have declared this mpox as the public health emergence of an international concern so that's that means it's an emergency which every country every nation has to stand up and work and do put in place some measures which can stop and contain and, and stop and prevent its continuous spreading from one person to another from one nation to another so stop calling it like covid 19 this is impulse please everyone here following dr bob Rwanda, let me hope that it's very clear so when you are being uh, like suspected or thinking that you have this you are expecting the signs we have seen that you may have some lashes on the skin you, you, we saw that you have some fever you may feel weak you have, you have, you have the lymphadenopathies uh, the strain of influence so you have seen a lot a lot and more signs so if you have one of those or more than one of those please get tested and when you are tested positive don't panic you can be treated 
and very soon you will cover and you will be well. Thank you so much for being with me for following uh, this nice short video which we chose to do in English so that we can reach a wider audience so that many of you can understand what you are talking about, what you are saying about this end box. God bless you. Thank you for being with us. If you have not yet subscribed, please like, share, comment and subscribe. Thank you. Another video is coming soon.